Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing a game called Haven. Uh, this game's been around for a little while. Uh, I picked it up almost a year ago when they did an update called the Couples Update. Uh, as you may have figured out from that really cool looking animated intro, uh, the game is about these two people in a relationship. Uh, before that update, uh, this it had to be a guy and a girl in a relationship. Uh, when they did the couples update, they set it up so that you can choose that both characters are girls, or both guys, if you wish. Uh, and, you know, for some, some reason, uh, that appealed to me. I can't imagine why. So, uh, let's just dive in and have a little look. Uh, I don't know what it's doing with my controller. Uh, let me see. Nintendo is funny. Accessibility, you can see there's a number of nice options there. Okay. Keep them in mind. Go with volume and stuff. I guess let's get started. Um, I don't really know what this game is about, apart from the fact that you play as this couple. Um, so I'm just gonna dive in and see what goes on. Which U and K would you like to play? This changes only the couple you play as it has no impact on story or gameplay. So yeah, by default you can see uh, you've got you've got a this girl here with white hair and this guy with the dark hair. It can be both guys if you wish, or both girls. Uh, and yeah, it doesn't impact anything apart from the fact that you know if you're queer, you might enjoy it more if it, if you can tweak things up a little bit. <laughs> Even it's not a challenging game. We recommend starting with the default difficulty level. However. I feel you would enjoy having it more than making it easier. There are different options in the pause menu available at all times. I'm getting the AMD buttons mixed up, that's the problem. Uh, the default is fine. There you go, you can see we've got some cuties there. Uh, I believe. It was suggested, someone asked, could you swap both their genders? So like the other character is the boy and the other one's the girl. Uh, but that was rejected on purpose because their personality is deliberately writ written to be like incongruous with what you'd expect for their gender or whatever. So swapping it around wouldn't make it as interesting. Uh, that's neat. Um, but yeah, you can just make them both girls. I like girls. <laughs> I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> What's that you got cooking? Apple juice stew with apple juice. Mm, didn't we have that yesterday or the day before? No, yesterday it was baked apple dew with apple dews, and the day before it was fried apple dews with apple dews. Oh, I remember now. Sorry, I'm doing what I can to switch up our meals. But in my defense, we have a pretty limited set of ingredients. Hey, I wasn't complaining. I'm glad that you're doing the cooking. Otherwise I'd be eating, I guess, <laughs> apple juice. <laughs> this is adorable. Mm -hmm. Oh, did you have a chance to look at the engine? Yeah, it does seem like it took some damage upon landing, but I should be able to fix that real quick. I also have some good news. What's that? I love you. <laughs> oh my. Oh, with the lights off. <laughs> Works for me. Uh, no, I didn't do that. Ugh, we must have run out of flow. Weren't you supposed to charge up the nest today? Excuse me if I was working on the engine. I can't do everything. No worries, I'll go get like some more salad. That's so cute. If I'm lucky, I'll stumble upon something to spice up the apple juice. 
<gasps> I'll come with you. Oh, <laughs> this is incredibly cute. Super adorable. A speed to switch characters. Oh no, down the thing. Down. I see. Look. Hold ZR to glide. Oh, I see. Whoosh. For a bit of a swoosh. Hold the left stick down to do a U turn. Oh, I see. Flip around. Over there, a flow thread. Flow thread. That's oh, that thing. That's an apple too. <laughs> um, looking for. Oh, hello, this looks like a boy. Perfect. Although it seems like one thread won't be enough. No worries, we'll find others. Okay, so you follow along these lines and it's like charging up our spaceship. I don't know. Three? Maybe four? Good thing there are plenty of flow threads around here. Oh, I can drift. Okay. Do you really think drifting is that useful? It's crucial. It allows you to change direction without having to stop all the time. Do I do that? We all do it. Oh, this is adorable. <laughs> the music's pretty fun too. Oh, sorry, birds. We didn't see you. Whoops! Try again. Yes! Just like that. One or two more threads, and we'll be all set. So I guess following all right. these threads. I'm all charged up. Yeah. Me too. We can go yeah, when you're ready. Charging the ship, or is it charging us like, directly? Go back to the ship. Can I grab these apple dudes? Apple dudes again. Who knows how long we're gonna be stuck here? We might as well stock up. Well, that was a bust. We were too slow. Plenty of threads out there. Oh, we have to get back to the ship fast. Okay. I'm learning how this game works. <laughs> Well, I think maybe we've already charged up and it's just I missed another thread for not getting it quickly enough or something. Apple dudes. Oh, they hold hands. Oh. <laughs> U-turn. It doesn't work if you warn me after you turn. <laughs> okay, back to the ship, I guess. Uh, into the nest. Oh, nest, not ship. I really like the art. Look at that. That is super duper cute. <laughs> All good. This should last us a few days. Now it's our turn to fill up. Huh? I'm hungry. Oh, uh, okay. What am I playing as now? Both the characters are over there. I I'm moving around independently as something else, I guess? Hey, we'll never be able to take off in these conditions. We absolutely have to finish repairing the nest. Thanks for letting me know. Do you need anything? No. Huh. Me neither. Better be here. I'm a little confused as to how I'm interacting with stuff, given I'm not moving around as a character at the moment. Oh, I can still go past by pressing the, the dash button. Okay. Oh, what if it's glide? I think I said it was glide. Uh, let's cook. 
Oh, hello. Uh, I guess just roasted apple dudes, that's all I've got. <laughs> oh, right. I'm getting the controls mixed up because I'm expecting the confirm button to be the other one. Um, that is one criticism I have, that it doesn't, like, it has uh, Nintendo-style prompts, but it doesn't swap those two buttons. Uh, eight. Done! Roasted apple dews with apple dews. I can't tell if you're actually excited about this, or if you just enjoy seeing me suffer. Noises. How long do you think this is gonna last? The flow? Well, if we keep our consumption in check, I think a few days. No, I meant us. Us here. How long until they come get us? Ah, uh, do we have to talk about this? We are going to need to at some point. We need to be prepared. We need a plan. I'm planning on finishing my plate without hearing about the apiary. Is that okay? Okay. Okay. And FYI, you are the one that ruined the mood, not me. Oh. I guess because it's night now, we have to. Let me leave. Look, it's locked. Yeah, I think they might be sleeping. You? All right. Let's talk about it. Fine. Uh, I was just gonna ask if you could switch off the light. Oh. You've been mulling it over this whole time? Of course I've been mulling it over this whole time. Thank you for adding one more thing to my mind. Hold on. Are you telling me you hadn't thought about it before? You know what? No, I hadn't thought about it. I'm trying not to think about the apiary. Enjoy what we have here, even if it isn't much. Um... Do you really think that they can come get us here? If we can take the flow bridge here, then so can they. But there's no way they can know where we are. Is there? I cut off the autonav, the astrolock. Even the landing was all manual. I'm just saying, let's prepare for the worst. At worst, I kill them. Whoa, you! What? If that's what it takes not to go back, I'll do it. No problem. Kill them, steal their ship. By the time they send more guys, we'll be far away. You're seriously not considering? Maybe not. Maybe I am. At worst, we'll know. You're scaring me. <laughs> oh, come on. You're totally safe. You're my teddy bear. I'm not sure how I should take this. <laughs> well, take me in your arms for a start. I'm getting the impression the APR is bad. Oh. You aren't dressed yet? I put on my pajamas. I mean, to get out. Well, see, I was just wondering, do we have to get out? Can't we just hang in the nest for once? Lounge around, read a book, watch a movie? We don't have movies. Right, sure, but you know what I mean. Come on, the weather's great. But the weather is always great. For now? Who knows? Tomorrow could be the beginning of the long winter months. Could last for years. One more reason to stock up on apple juice. Mm. You know, always being right is not necessarily oh, a good blushing. quality. <laughs> on the contrary, many people find it very unappealing. Oh, okay, you're blushing. Mm. You? Not sure. 
<laughs> oh, they're very cute. Adorable. <laughs> I, I guess what is oh oh that's so cute. Look at them. Ah. Oh. Do you remember where the apple juice were? Could we try and pick something else for a change? shaking it's shaking it's shaking a lot Is it over? Seems like it. Uh, anything broken? No. No, I don't think so. <sighs> well, except... <sighs> it's not all lost. Well, it is. A bit. Look, we can always search the islet, try and find a way to get to the other side. Such as? I don't know. A rope, a jetpack, spring-loaded shoes, anything. I don't want to be stuck here. It sucks. <sighs> Me neither. That's why we'll have to find something. Okay. Oh, I see. On the other side there. This is a pretty one. I'm not sure if it makes a difference. I, uh, I uh, think which I found character something. I'm playing as. <gasps> Call me crazy, but this looks like a Bluton. Yup, it looks like a flow bridge. Kind of like the one we took to get here. But smaller? Is that possible? Why not? We still don't really know how the flow bridges work in space. But if the phenomenon can happen on a macro scale, then why not on this one? If there can be flow between two planets, why not two bits of a planet? Okay. If this really is a flow bridge, I'm not sure what we're waiting for. What? Flow bridges are linking one place to another, right? So this one definitely leads someplace. Wait, you want to just get on there without knowing where it goes? It goes elsewhere. I think that's as good a start as any. <sighs> mm. <laughs> Do we have everyone? Okay? Oh, here. <laughs> then we're good. <laughs> Looks like we're on another islet. Yeah. The bridge seems to be a link between the islets. If there are any others like this, we may be able to get back to the nest. Do you see what I'm seeing? Uh, a big ugly lizard? No, the mushroom's on its back. Looks like a type of hygrocybe rubicens. Ah, is that good news? Like, can we eat it? Oof, not at all. Unless you're looking for a quick way to unload your kidneys. But don't you find that symbiosis amazing? The movements of the lizard are helping spread the spores. As far as what the lizard is gaining, I'll have to study that closer. Maybe it doesn't even know. Maybe we should tell it. No way. You don't get in the way of Mother Nature's plans. I'll make sure I remember that next time you have salad stuck in your teeth. 
This is so adorable. Oh, oh, you can pet the lizard. Oh, wonderful. Have you ever seen such a thing? No, never. Must be an endemic species. I wonder if it's edible. Only one way to find out. Yes, you're right. I'll pick up some berries and run some tests. First, we'll need to observe any cutaneous reactions. Then we'll cook them to eliminate bacteria. Mmm, it's peppery. You did not. <laughs> Go ahead, try it. I'm sure you'll love it. Hmm. <coughs> oh, yeah, that is peppery. Lightweight. Off we go. Let's pick these. I'm not sure these will go great with the apple dews. But where there's a meal, there's a way. You know what doesn't go great with apple dews? Apple dews. I don't have one. Not that. It isn't ripe yet. Ooh. Lots of options. Yeah, it doesn't seem like you can swap the the confirmation and um the confirm and go back buttons in the menu, which is weird because like it's got a specific option for Nintendo prompts here. Hmm. It's, a, it's a little bit off-putting. I mean, obviously I'm really enjoying this, so. <laughs> Oops. Away from children. Anti grav boot. Start and select you the same thing. This is where we came from. All right, I know. Do you think that's impressive? We can fly too. <laughs> I assume there'll be some combat because I have fighting gloves, but I don't know what I'm gonna be fighting yet. I'm curious about that. Seems like exploration is a big part of this uh, experience. I've been doing quite a lot of that. seem like which character you play as makes any difference, but maybe in combat it will. I haven't gotten to that part yet. My different combat stats or something. See, the one you're not playing as just follows you anyway. I believe this game has co-op, so you can play as uh, you and Kay separately uh, with multiple players, which is, which is neat. Might give that a try later. Yeah, I'm not really seeing much of anywhere to go here. Missing something? <laughs> can't actually, like, jump or anything like that as far as I know. Just sort of get along. 
Did I just feel you pinching my butt in passing? How could I possibly achieve that? <laughs> Here we go. A new place. Seems like our mini flow bridge wasn't a unique occurrence. Good, because those things are really useful. Here we go. Oh, Bobcon. Wow, that's actually. What is that? We should take a closer look. Any idea what's underneath our feet, Mrs. Geologist? I'm a biologist. Isn't that the same thing? Biology, the living. Geology, <laughs> the rocks. And what makes you think this is not living, pray tell? Uh, it looks like a dust deposition. Some kind of rust. And it looks like this kind of rust is particularly sensitive to flow. What? Look beneath your feet. Oh, there's vegetation underneath. It was probably smothered. Good thing we came this way. Great, we can bring that back to the nest to study it. That way, look. It looks like the rust has formed into a bigger chunk. Okay, so I can clear this stuff by going through it. Even the apple dew shrubs are completely covered. I hope this one will yield some nice and juicy fruit to thank us. Rust! Saw that. Take a long bird. Another flow bridge! That's great. It means there must be others. If we're lucky, they'll bring us back to the nest. Oh, no, stop it, please. Alright. Isn't this the bridge we took to get here? It is. Actually, quite helpful they do that. I'm having a little trouble keeping track of where I am. <laughs> Make sure they don't get squished. Mine rust. I got a big one. There should probably be a button to like turn the camera in the way you're facing. Doesn't look like there's a button to do that. I'm missing it. It's so adorable. Look at those cuties. Should find the nest if we keep going north. Explain to me how you know which way north is on this planet. Uh, we should find the nest if we keep going straight ahead. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, hello. Are you an enemy? Good deal. Come on. Don't be scared. Are you a, a friend? Bug like you. Good around. 
around here. Always be useful. You've never heard of boba nuts? They're one Ooh. of the most nutritious nuts. 25% carbohydrates, 50% protein, 75% lipids. That adds up to 150%. Precisely. A great mystery of modern <laughs> science. <laughs> You're pulling my leg, aren't you? Maybe. But once you have a taste of my boba salad, you will forget all about it. Good stuff. And I thought backwards. this planet was supposed to be a desert. Deserted, not a desert. According to the archives, a colonization plan had been considered by the apiary, with Exonova as the main provider. But the planet was eventually classified as inhospitable. Let me guess. High seismic activity? I don't know. The file doesn't say anything about that. Hmm. I hope we don't have any more unpleasant surprises. Oh, whoops. Oh, all right. That's probably fine. <laughs> We're here. We found the nest. But in what state? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. There is no way this thing is flying again. Don't say that. You can make a rock fly with the right tools. Well, maybe. But not this one. Both wings are wasted. The propellers were ripped off. And I'm not even done checking the inside. We weren't really planning on leaving, were we? We don't really have another place to go anyway. I'm tired. Why are we always so unlucky? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Hold on. We decide to escape the apiary, which apparently no one has managed to do before us. We punch in some coordinates really at random, only because some obscure document from Exanova vaguely attested to the existence of a habitable planet. By some kind of miracle, we cross the boundaries of the apiary without getting caught. We travel across space in a Class D ship that is totally not designed for that. And in spite of the fact that this is not all terrain, we land without breaking anything. We find food and flow on site, even though we hadn't really planned for it. Finally, we get hit with an earthquake, all right. But we get out of it unscathed. The only real consequence is that the nest is a little bit busted. <laughs> and you think that we're unlucky? You, we are the luckiest people in the universe. That's, that's one way to see it. This planet is our chance to start a new life, with our own rules. Away from the apiary, from the matchmaker, and all that bloot. And I'd rather endure a thousand earthquakes than risk being away from you. <sighs> what did you say this planet was called again? Source. Source. The beginning of something. Seems like it.
really sure what following all these flow lines actually does for me, but... I think we scared them. We almost missed this one. For here or to go? To go. Too bad. Adorable. <laughs> oh my god. This is very sweet. Very, very adorable. Very sweet. Whoa! What a mess! And now the nest is all akimbo. This feels weird. Yeah, we'll need to find a way to correct that. But it can wait until tomorrow. I think we've had our share for the day. We deserve some time to relax. If you know what I mean. You can do whatever you want, but I am going to bed. <laughs> oh, cute. I'm not hungry. I never thought I would hear you say that in my whole life. I guess my stomach has a deep connection to the nest condition. Do you want to tidy up a bit? No. Tomorrow. I don't feel strong enough right now. I was figuring I could try cooking with a new ingredient, but I guess we gotta rest first. Puddles. You okay? Uh, you? Wake up! It's okay. I'm here. That was just a nightmare. Everything's fine. That... that wasn't a nightmare. Sure it was. Rest easy. No! I was awake. I could hear you. I just couldn't move. Or I'll sleep paralysis. I couldn't breathe. It was horrible. Yeah, I'm familiar with that. For real? It used to happen when I was a teenager. You feel something weighing on your stomach? Yeah. On my chest. What was it? I don't know. I used to call it the ball. Because sometimes it felt like a huge ball was crushing me. Oh. No, that didn't happen to me. I wouldn't wish it upon you. For me, it resolved itself when I left the foster home. For you, it may be related to the nest. But I don't want to leave the nest. That's not what I meant. You're stuck to the bed. The nest is stuck to the ground. There must be something in that. You've been flying in this thing for years. I bet you're upset to see it in this condition. Huh. <sighs> no kidding. Which means that if we fix up the nest, this'll all go away? Could be. Worst case scenario, the nest will be fixed. <laughs> yeah. Well, I hope we'll eventually find the missing parts then. So I can get fixed up too. All right. Now we can see a lot clearer. Yeah, we're not there yet, but that should do the trick for now. Now we just need to figure out how to level the nest. The tractor globe is probably done charging. Let's bring it outside. Do you think that will be enough to lift it? I hope so, because I have no idea what else we can do. Great globe. Got this thing? I don't think so. <laughs> oh. 
What if we grabbed a little snack for the road? Huh, sounds good. I'll bring the first aid kit as well, just in case. <gasps> Yeah, let's do a little bit of cooking. I see apple too. Do it. Use that one? Maybe I have enough of it or Oh dear. Did it move? No, I don't think so. Bulging bloot! Ugh, it's over. It's not going back straight. We'll never be able to fix it. We are condemned to living on an incline in a broken ship forever. Until our body adapts and one of our legs starts shrinking to even us out. That's not how things work. I know that's not how things work. Nothing is working the way it should. Especially not this looting tractal globe poor thing is doing what it can it wasn't designed to lift ships in the first place i know but i was hoping it would go the extra mile right now the batteries drain out even before lifting the nest off the ground what if we plugged it into a flow spring i thought about that but we'd have to be able to seal the pipe shut unfortunately i don't think they make gaskets for flow springs from a distant planet perhaps we could make one with what Paper mache Remember yesterday when I told you that rust scatters when it comes in contact with flow? We could use that feature to bend it into shape. You could do that? I don't think I could sculpt a nude statue of you or a super complex component. But molding a gasket? That seems doable. That's awesome! <laughs> Hold on! Let's not start pushing before the panties are pulled down. Excuse me? You've never heard of that saying? No. <laughs> Must be a true thing, then. That means let's not celebrate before we... Yeah, yeah. I got it. Anyway, how much rust do you need in order to... <laughs> pull the panties down? Uh, I don't know. Four or five blocks like those we already got? Okay, so let's try and find that. I think we've got everything we need to mold a joint for the tractor globe. All right, then. Ready when you are. I'm just waiting on you. I can't wait to get going. So where else can you go to do this? Um... Sorry, I kind of missed my U-turn. We'll do better next time. Being a floor spring. Strong little tractor globe, you're about to get a brand new joint. Oh, yep, that's what I was supposed to do. So? Well, it fits. That's a good sign. Let's get this ball rolling. What? What? Haven't you heard of that one either? Oh no, I have. It's just a really old fashioned saying. Let's get the show on the road. Okay, that's worse. <laughs> Can you just switch on the tractor globe? 
please. Oh, they're adorable. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh, I think it's working. We just need to fix up the wings and the turbine and the hypo propellers and don't be so cynical getting the nest out of the crevasse was quite a feat huh no don't get me wrong i am genuinely delighted i love fixing things up but i don't think we need to get started right away <sighs> that's a relief before we start fixing anything we'll need to find the replacement parts Oh yeah, there's a bunch of stuff we need to get in half. We'll do some exploring to find those things. What just happened? It broke. Seems like our anti-grav boots aren't powerful enough to lift us on top of the airflows. Could you tune them up? Mm, not without the proper tools. Mm -mm. I assume the next step is to like go to some of the other little islets and explore some more. Here we go. Are you sure we want to go back there? Why not? Well, we've already looked there, and I'm not sure what more we can find. We're looking for parts to fix the nest. Oh, yeah, of course. It seems like we should search some the new, new places. places. Don't you think? Makes sense. I saw another bridge a little further down. My guess is we're more likely to find some good stuff over there. Or bad stuff. I'm just saying we'll find some stuff. Jeez. Okay, so we're not going that way right now. Oh, I see there's a glow up there. Okay. And we'll do... This way is also full of rust. Not for long. Oh, it all goes away if you get all the force pieces, I guess. What was that noise? Ugh, oh, my stomach. Be careful. These creatures oh. don't seem to be in their right mind. Fighting? I did notice that. Sweet. Seems like it was the rust that made him aggressive. Any idea why? It could just be because they're uncomfortable. If the rust hurts them, that would explain why they're turning violent. But it doesn't explain why they're attacking us and not fighting amongst themselves. Maybe the rust is taking over their nervous system in some way, like a parasite. 
Or maybe it's because of pheromones. You can also say, I don't know. I'd understand. Okay, I don't know. You hear that, Oink? You're a scientific mystery. Oink. His name is Oink now. <laughs> 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 that was the wrong way. So, damage there, right? Yeah, it did. Uh, I think I'll be okay. A little bit of damage. Let's work to heal, like, when you go back to the nest, or if you actually need to... Oh, there was, like, a cure thing in the nest. I guess I can shoot that. I have a good one. A bit of rust for your collection? Oh, cool. I don't have this one yet. Mm -hmm. she want from us? One to go. I got this. That didn't seem to bother him much. Oh, flute. Go, girl. He didn't like that too much. You know what to do. I got this. Bye bye. That was easy. A little confusing. Enjoying the exploration more than the combat so far, but as soon as I get used to the combat system, I'll get a bit better at it. What a bug? Better. A seed. It must have hooked on when we brushed past the plant. And it just so happens it chose the one with the green thumb. Clever seed. Natural selection doing its work. Do you think you're gonna plant it? What do you think? <laughs> yeah. I don't even know why I asked. If we find enough of them, we could start a little vegetable patch at the nest. I vote yes. Motion approved. Unanimously. Just need to find some more seeds. Easy enough, don't you think? Not so sure. If these plants have few natural predators, they might have somewhat of a slow reproductive process. We'll just need to keep an eye out. You can count on me. Eh. What? Nothing. I just can't imagine you spotting seeds right out of the wilderness. Says the chick who's incapable of finding her stuff when it's right under her nose. That's not the same. I mean, plants are kind of my specialty. So? I know what a seed looks like, don't I? Certainly. I'm sure I'll find more than you. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Wanna bet? Don't tempt me.
be nice to have some sort of map, given that this seems to be very much an exploration focused game. Could be. That's it. That was the last one. Clearly, we're breathing a lot easier without all this rust. This one, nice shot. Achoo! Oh, ugh. take that. Your turn on it. Done and done. Ah, are you a nice one? You that'll teach them. I'll keep them at bay. This one's mine. He's right for the picking. Harvest time. Shield up. Oh, oh flute. Great job. You're welcome. One left. Just like real time combat. Sort of thing. Boom. Ugh, you. Make way. Keep them coming. It's, it's, it's just frightening a little puzzling. Well done! Done and done. Okay, now I'm really starving. Imagine how I feel. <laughs> oh yeah, she's very hungry. I'm not sure if there's like a quick way to get back to the high or I think the hive is this way. Again, yeah, I'd like a map or something. There doesn't seem to be one. We know what's that way. Hi, that's where I wanna be, so let's go. Oh no! Yeah, here we go. Back to five. Sorry, Nest. I got the name wrong. Uh, same basic idea. Oh, you could do some more reorganizing because you picked up the thing and moved it around a little while ago. <laughs> I'm done. It's all straightened out. Everything's tidy and clean. Besides us, that is. <laughs> yeah, we are kind of stinky. Off to the shower then? Ah, Bloot. What is it? I just mopped the bathroom. Oh. Do you think we can marinate another 10 to 15 minutes in our own filth? <laughs> Honestly, can do. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, I think I just use this thing. Oh, oh, that uses those health kits. I'm not sure how to get more of those. That's a little scary. You? Yeah? I see you've brushed your hair in the shower again. How can you tell? It's not draining. Uh, sorry. Oh no. <laughs> That's a relatable experience, yes. <laughs> Living in a house of long hair to people. <laughs> okay, yeah, we need to do some eating. more of those. I think you just get two ingredients at a time. 
Bobo Masala? Do it. Play it, Bobo. Do it. Do. Looks like these heal you too, so the fact that medkits can heal you, they're not necessarily your only option. Good. Roasted Apple Dew does not heal you, it just increases bond, I think. Boba. It's kind of a regressive dish, isn't it? Hmm? Why'd you say that? Well, it's a lot of fat and carbs. You're usually more fine dining. Hmm. That's true. There's more if you want. Definitely. <laughs> that was cute. 18, 19, 20. Keep on going, my love. You're strong. 21, 22. You know I'm able to count on my own, right? Yeah, but I like to watch when you do push-ups. That way I feel like I'm participating. You could also do push-ups. <laughs> no. <laughs> no need for that. I am naturally muscular. There's no such thing as naturally muscular. For real? Arm wrestle? <laughs> no. It's a trap. If I win, you'll complain that I hurt your arm. And if I let you win, I'll be hearing about it for weeks. Ding, ding, ding! Win by default. See? Naturally muscular. <laughs> oh, cuties. <laughs> oh, adorable. <laughs> I I'm past an hour, so I probably should wrap up now, but this is super duper cute. Uh, I am really enjoying this. Um, I don't quite get the hang of the combat system yet. Like, I feel like I should have been able to avoid some of that damage uh, that was that we were taking, but uh, I guess I'll work it out. <laughs> uh, the interactions between the characters are just uh, just incredibly adorable. Uh, and the exploration seems to be a lot of fun. Oh, I need some more seeds. Okay. Oh, okay, and here's the pieces of the nest itself. I'm guessing, yeah, I can see, like, we can probably upgrade our stats by putting more stuff into these points here. Eventually. It's possible that when I fill up the bond bar, which is that one in the top, in the left there, I think, that it'll, like, give us something for that. Uh, maybe that's how you get more stats or skill points? I don't know yet. Um, this part is still kind of strange. I don't know who it is walking around, given that we can see both characters, they're over there. Um, it's, it's just a little bit weird. Um, but otherwise, yeah, I'm really enjoying this. Um, it's very, very cute, the music is really nice, the voice acting is really good, the characters are adorable. Um, the exploration is a lot of fun, you get, get like a sense of... It would, be, it would be nice to have a bit of a map, but... M might be something you unlock as you progress. Is this hey, a bit we'll like never be map. able to take off in these conditions. We absolutely have to finish repairing the nest. Thanks for letting me know. Like, there's a possibility that we get some kind of map as we progress because I am pretty early in the game, but um, it's also possible it's just meant to be a like discovery kind of experience. So I don't know. I guess I'll see. <sighs> Anyway, yeah, that was the first hour or so of Haven. Uh, this game is super duper cute, and it's a lot of fun. Um, in terms of criticisms, uh, the thing I talked about with the A and B buttons, I feel like you should be able to swap which ones confirm and which ones cancel, especially if you're using like a Nintendo controller. And it doesn't seem like you can do that. So that's a bit of a weird omission. Uh, in terms of like, most other things. The combat is confusing to me, but 
not really a huge focus of the gameplay, so I'm not too too bothered, and I think I'll get the hang of it. Uh, where oh oh duo okay okay I I th I think you meant to charge them up with the same ability, and then it'll like hit harder if they do it at the same time or something like that. Okay, that hasn't come up yet. I assume I have to put some points into the duo ones before that'll work. Actually, must. Definitely a real thing. This dialogue log is also really good. Just to, to recap, it would be cool if you could select them and hear the hear the voice acting again, like you can in some games with those kind of logs. But uh, it, you don't need that. It's fine. Uh, what else? Uh, the cooking system seems pretty basic, but fun. You get some cute stuff comboed together. Nice. Uh. And of course, you know, the fact that they even patched the game so that instead of having a dude dating a gal, you can have two dudes or two gals and it doesn't affect the gameplay at all and you can just, just have gay a gay couple as as your as your main characters that you play as just because that that's that's more fun for you know certain people. That's just it's it's nice. It's nice that that's in the game. Um, and I mean, look at them, they're adorable. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, um, yeah, like, I, ha I have some, you know, minor, oh, well, that's neat, look, you can see, like, the stuff you're carrying here on the, on the screen, your inventory of whatever's, cool. I'm guessing that those are the missing parts, and they'll, like, light up as I get them as well. Neat. Uh, out there if you want. Of the world. <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's about all I've got to say about this. So, yeah, this is Haven. Uh, it's got some, re this real cute couple here. Uh, and I like him. And I think it's good. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, about it. So, bye!